A registered sex offender was caught in the ceiling above the women's dressing room at a local gym. Our Javier Guerra kicks off our team coverage tonight on this story. He's live in front of Freedom Fitness where this happened. This is the one on um, SPID. Javi, tell us more about this. Bring us up to date. Well, Katia, shock is what went through many gym members' heads whenever they found out of the arrest of Thomas Garcia. Several women I spoke to said that this won't hold them back from working out. I'm a little bit disturbed that that happened and it shouldn't have happened. One of the biggest things people are wondering is how 44-year-old Thomas Garcia got into the building. That was a, a big shock to me just because uh, I've never heard of anything like that, especially at, at the gym I've been going to for eight years. The arrest happened on Monday after Corpus Christi police received a call around 2.20 in the morning. According to a police report, when police first checked the ceiling above the women's dressing room, they didn't notice anything, but they decided to check again, this time using a ladder. That's when they realized the ceiling tiles had been moved enough to allow a view of the dressing room. Police also found a makeshift bed in the mechanical room. After filing an open records request, Chris Six News learned Garcia is a registered sex offender. The woman we spoke to said it's disturbing, but they'll continue to work out at the gym. I feel sorry for homeless people. You know, they, they're looking for places to go, but that's not the way to do it. Um, but anyway, hopefully they've uh, figured out how he got in and prevent that from happening again. I mean, as soon as they saw what was going on, figured it out, they took care of, rectified the situation. County Jail. Now, they also say that damages cost about $1,500 to repair because of the damaged air duct and uh, several ceiling tiles. Now, that's all for right now, live from the Freedom Fitness on SPID. Javier Guerra, Chris 6 News.